kids. Okay. This is a fantastic simulation um, that's going to show you what happens when waves travel from one medium to another. So we're going to look at what happens to the reflected wave. We're going to talk, talk about what happens to the uh, transmitted wave. So if I hit start, first of all, you can see here's one of the mediums. Here's the other medium. If I hit start, you'll notice, well, geez, not, it just kept traveling through because you'll notice up here <clears throat> that essentially it's the same medium because it's the same rope here and the same rope there. So, well, then, duh, the wave just travels straight through. So let's have the wave travel to a, a, a thicker medium. So this would be like the, the light going from air to, let's say, water or glass or something. Okay. So if that happens, if I hit run, you can see the light definitely slows down. So you can definitely see that. If I hit run again, it definitely slows down. In fact, do you notice if, if I was to measure wavelength from here to here, and I realize that's not exactly a wavelength, but you can definitely see from there to there, it got shorter. And that has to happen. And hopefully you've already discovered why that has to happen. But so that, you know, the wavelength is going to change. But uh, if I hit run again, so you can see that the wavelength changes, it gets slower. Um, but the transmitted wave, you can see, is in phase with the start. See how the, the start was up and this one is up, so therefore the transmitted wave is in phase. But the reflected wave, you can see, is out of phase with the original one. And the reason that is, is because this is acting more like a fixed end. Because it's the light's going, hey, I can travel easy, 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 easy. Oh, geez, it's hard to travel over here. So this is acting like a fixed end. Or sometimes this is called a hard reflection. So if it's a hard reflection, it's going to bounce back out of phase. It's going to be bounce back on the other side. Whereas if I reverse this, so I make this 30 and this 10, okay, you can see, first of all, you can see it speed up. You can see when it does speed up, like if I pause it, do you see how the wavelength, and again, I understand this is not exactly the wavelength, but you get the idea. The wavelength is actually increasing. You can see that, and that has to happen, you know, thinking about, you know, N equals C over V. Um, but if you notice, the transmitted pulse is still in phase because the transmitted pulse is always going to be in phase. But in this case, the reflected pulse that comes back is also in phase. You can see it come back in phase. Why is that? Because this, where it's like, hey, it's hard to travel, it's hard to travel, it's hard to travel, it's hard to travel, it's easy to travel. This is acting more like a free end, okay? And this is, sometimes this is called a soft reflection, so it bounces back on the same side, okay? Um, I hope that helps. I think it's a really cool simulation. So, bye kids!